there was a show on Broadway called Bubbling Brown Sugar, for which I contributed some of the lyrics and music. 2020? This is the 4th of March. Let me tell you something. Let me tell you something. My mommy was born on the 4th of March in Atlanta, Georgia. I think it was something like 1906. That's the same year I think that Josephine Baker was born. This is the 4th of March, 2020. On the piano, which is my favorite instrument. If I'm playing, that is. I love playing. People love to hear you singing. That's why I started singing. Well, we're not going to talk about how well my singing is. This is the 4th of March, 2020. My sight is not exactly 2020. It doesn't matter. That is my inner sight. Do I see you? Yes, I see you. I see all of you. From the outside, Angela. To the inside, Angela. songs I wrote in a sequence. It was called, What Did You See? It's about seeing, hearing, feeling. This is a beach, sandy beach. Who would think a sandy beach could ever become? for microscopes to examine things. Things become what people make them. Sometimes it seems that people become what people make them. What is a friend? Somebody that ninja money? Or is this a kid that enjoys the same thing that you do? Like a ride? In your family car, maybe? Oh, I love families too. There's so many things I love. I love people. I love the world. Love is my favorite word. Water is my favorite drink. If it's a rainy day and you're a child and can you have fun even if it's raining with someone that you, you know, really have a feeling for, oh, and so it was my brother. Well, actually, we're all brothers and sisters. Uh, but there was a song of mine called Traveling Band, and it was the first one that was recorded. Uh, and that got me into this particular organization. And it was recorded by a man who also played the sidekick with a, a program that stayed on for quite a while, but it was by about a real historical character that they called Daniel Boone, who was an explorer in America. And my song said... Give me your hand, come and join my a traveling band. Reach on up to every man, spread some love wherever you can. How 
How about down the grocery store? Never again. Captain sadness. Now you got friends. Share your deadness. Loneliness ends when you join my traveling band. If you are cold, you'll be warm there. If you're afraid, there's no harm there. People who care will be there to lift you up if you should fall. One and all, join my laughter. Rent it all out forever and after. Open it heart, join in hands wherever you can. Come and join my traveling band. May I have my tambourine? Do you have a tambourine at home? Well, maybe your uncle doesn't tell you, but there's some old tambourine in the attic. Well, this is not uh, from an attic. This is from my living room. And somebody, tambourine played kind of hard. And they also broke, never, actually, if you have a friend, you, and are uh, you playing with a toy? And you have to accidentally break it? Well, maybe somebody will help you replace it. Can I have your clap? Give me your hand. Come and join my traveling band. Reach on out to every man. Spread some love wherever you can. Wubba dubba do yubba dubba. Never again. Kevin sadness. Now you got a friend. Share your gladness. Loneliness ends when you join my traveling band. If you are cold, you'll be warm there. Don't be afraid. There's no harm there. People who care. We'll be there to lift you up if you should fall. There was a man called Frank Lesser. He wrote positive films like. called The Music Man. At one time, there were these signs around his office and it said, Damn Yankees. It said, How to succeed in business without really trying. I'd love to know about that one. But from this particular show, there was a sign on the wall and it said, The Music Man. All my friends out there in the Midwest, Middle West, specifically Indiana. Seventy-six trombones. Let the big parade. Listen to that. Now you listen. Hundred and ten coronets right behind. They were founded. Everyone was astounded. And these things that had some metal on them. Yes, they were founded, or is it foundered for foundry? Because in India they have a lot of foundries. I grew up around that in the Middle East. I love you. Yeah, and your mom? I love you more because they, they resettle. People don't always stay the same with the same place. They don't always stay the, 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 stay the same way. But they're down in Atlanta. Georgia. See, we're traveling. Georgia. The whole day through. as I go along. 76 trombones led the big parade. Once upon a time, there were lots of parks 
I was in a park last Saturday. It was called Jackie Robinson Park. Anybody here heard of Jackie Robinson? He was a player of baseball. Actually, that's where I went to school. It was cold up there, but don't think I didn't fight that cold Michigan lake. Lake Michigan? You might not want to go to school every day, but if you want to learn as I want to learn. Yeah, you walk fast, that helps you keep warm too. Northwestern days. Gave you an opportunity to meet, to meet. We have the same goals as I have. We were in music school together. And there's a dear lady, dear lady, who grew up listening to choruses sing. And this particular place was called Lutkin Hall. Give me a home. Home is another one of my favorite works. Where the buffalo roam. When Daniel Boone, the explorer, and his assistant came along. It was depicted in this series on, yes, in those days it was television. Where the buffalo roam on the range, an American song, American song called Home. My favorite word, Home on the Range, where the deer and the antelope play. It could be sheep that you sing. What's not that common nowadays? What's not that common nowadays? Deer and antelope? Oh, deer maybe, but what about antelope? Times are changing. Seldom is heard. An encouraging word. Let's go. Where skies are not cloudy. Today. sunshine when you smile for me. It's always sunshine when you show me how happy you can be. Let's spread some joy. Let's spread some joy. How about where I live right now? I live in Harlem. And a favorite song in Harlem that makes people I say, one jump and want to dance. I love to dance, but they gave me piano lessons. Here's a test for you. In fact, there's a 
society that's dedicated to him. You are a fine vocalist. A fine journalist. You guys like to read and write? Well, maybe you'll grow up one day to be a journalist who's published. His name is Billy Strayhorn. Writer of lyrics and music. One of the pianists. You should take the A train. If you want to get to Harlem, that's where I live. Chicago Shuffle. I'm from Chicago. I am from Chicago. 2020, don't you forget it. My full name is Emmerline Kemp, they tell me. K E M P. Before my father and mother made it to Chicago from Atlanta, Georgia, after they were married, they came through St. Louis, or St. Louis, and a period conductor of a band that took place in Memphis much of the time, had the ambition to bring his traveling band someplace. He wanted to come to the World's Fair. That particular year, that particular, that particular year, oh, watch it. He wanted to come to, to the World's Fair that particular year, but he didn't know until after he got there, he didn't have enough money. But anyway, it was all right. He prayed a lot. He thought a lot. And one of the wives behind men, like Andy, who said, I want to do it. Mrs. Handy said, when after they were married, we're not going to only go to the fair in Chicago. We're going to travel. You know where they honeymooned? They honeymooned in Cuba. And that, of course, was 
when they had days of radio series, that was a theme for the Lone Ranger. Okay, and that was part of the William Tell Overture. The 8th of March every year is International Women's History Month, and I want to recall the kind of uh, association that uh, American women from America, who happen to be black Americans, uh, that they have the association or the connection with women of England, the UK I should say. Things become what people make them, that's one of the songs from uh, children's concept songs, okay. because I've done uh, quite a lot and thoughtfully uh, about children and with them. Uh, there was this particular uh, portion of, uh, that we had set aside. Then a children's so a song having to do specifically with art. Uh, I'll give you an example of a show that uh, I did. And this has this gotten a little political because this was back in the time when the Iron Curtain, as they called it, was up. Mm -hmm. And then uh, when the Iron Curtain was down, uh, I was actually there. Not at the moment, but I was there where the uh, gate was. And I was playing uh, with a spectacular artist who's from a place called Philadelphia, Pennsylvania. <laughs> Uh, and who has taken her, ta her talent to Europe and many other places as I've been pleased and gratified and very appreciative to be able, able to do. Oh, yes. yes, Queen Anna is Wonderful. the name, of, yes, uh huh. And she's lived a lot of the time in Berlin, actually. Uh, of course, after the war was over, that's WW2, uh, and uh, it was after I went. But uh, I'm going to go back to another name that I mentioned, I think, which was Josephine Baker who came out of uh, Missouri, St. Louis, uh, Missouri. Uh, and uh, my father, as I said, had, uh, and mother, after they were married, they went through there. Uh, that was another one of the places that was a pleasure for me to be, knowing that my folks had been here before I, and some member uh, of the family by marriage had lived there in that town. And actually, radio, I'm going back to radio now, for a means of uh, method of communication. I know we got all these you know, fabulous new inventions, but there are people who don't even have access to, uh, say, commercial radio or to radio that doesn't static or whatever. But there were people listening all over the country on, I think they called it short wave, whatever it is. If anybody has any idea of what the, the correct term for, uh, for that kind of radio nowadays, if the people were going to do it, to listen to something like a blog, as they call it, uh, which can be done. Uh, which is something about seeing same seeing person on, say, Skype, a whole program on Skype. I would like to say um, at my morning uh, breakfast table, uh, what would I like to do? Well, I would like to have a program uh, with some sort of communication system. When I was a child, like three or four years old, and uh, oh, getting older, there was a program called Wings Over Jordan with wonderful music. I'd like to bring some of that music uh, in my time, uh, in a style that I would love doing a lot, uh, we can just call it people style, because that's what I want to be a communicator, basically, be it through music, be it through speech, be it through uh, saying to someone that appreciates being corrected. And if there are things that you hear in my speech that should be corrected, don't hesitate to say, Emmy, would you please say that word over again? And I'm one that wants to find reasons I answer questions, and I'm looking for answers in some specific kind of investigation. There was a show on Broadway called Bubbling Brown Sugar, for which I contributed some of the lyrics and music. Harlem takes you Shakes you Makes you Feel I never knew I could feel As great as this Wow, I really got shot for 
feel the rhythm that shouts dance forever. The beats in my heart, Harlem's my kind of heaven. Music is pumping through every vein. Bubbles are bumping around in my brain. It's the first time in life I'm having a ball. I wasn't living it all. Now I know what was missing was color. Being proper could not have been duller. I learned how to be free. Now I just gotta be. If I'm lucky, I just may survive. Harlem makes you feel. Harlem makes you feel. Harlem makes you feel it's great to be alive. Now, Sam, we're gonna gather all of you together and take you to our neighborhood. We've got something for you. We've got bubbling brown sugar. If you feel you wanna jump and shout, go ahead on. Bubbling brown sugar, joy's what we're all about. We've got your bubbling brown sugar, bubbling with the happy to be. A bubbling brown sugar is a stimulating column treat. I've got your bubbling brown sugar, babe. If you feel you wanna jump and shout, do it. Bubbling brown sugar, yeah. Joy is what I am all about. I have got your bubbling brown sugar. A bubbling with a happy beat. A bubbling brown sugar is a stimulating Harlem treat. Harlem makes you feel. Harlem makes you feel. Harlem makes you feel. It's great to be alive. Thank you.